Hey guys, we're at Urobashi Akihabara in Akihabara. This is Tokyo Paul and we're gonna walk around. I'm gonna go to a floor I've never been to on the live streams and uh, explore. Also, check out uh, my new book on Amazon called Japan Info Guide Tips and Photos for an Amazing Trip to Japan. Let's see, so, let's see, uh, we are on the first floor. I'm gonna head to, uh, I don't know, let's see. This is the bunny year, happy 2023. I'm gonna go, I think I've been to the second floor. I think I'm gonna go to higher floors today. Probably like uh, floor number four or six. I think I've been to floor whoa so floor two is sake beer wine 4k monitors usb peripherals uh pcs and usb flash drives let's go to number uh floor three all right let's go maybe the stairway is a little bit more boring i imagine let's go Floor 3 is cameras, camcorders, tripods, hair dryers, cosmetics, and perfume. Huh, I don't think I've actually quite walked around here. Oh, there's a Japanese, uh, let's see, what is this, uh, mouthwash? Oh, Panasonic uh, toothbrushes. Whoa, it's uh, gray called adults whoa it's another 200 bucks like the top looks like a normal toothbrush I, I guess it shakes i think most of us maybe in the states we use oral b whoa look at that it's like there's no bottom it's kind of held up by this uh thing here so i'm just gonna walk around oh i think i have been here basically i was here in the last live stream and uh yeah, so that means I'm gonna go to another floor. <laughs> Let's see what other floor I haven't been to. This was floor three. Floor three is cameras, watches, beauty repair, counters. You yeah, guys, one thing you may not know about Japan, there's still a lot of repair services for your electronics, such as watches, uh, phones. So in case one of your electronic breaks during your trip or if you live here, just go to a neighborhood Yonobashi or, uh, you know, we say Denki Asan or check it out. Go to your neighborhood electronic shop, maybe they'll fix it. Home appliances is five, four is TVs and audio. So this is the TVs and audio floor. Whoa. I don't think I was walking around the TV floor as much. 55 inch screens are the rage. Oh my. Regza. I think this is by Toshiba. Yeah, it says Toshiba. Oh, look at that. A lot of TVs around here. They all look the same to me, man. And uh, look at the bottom one 55 inch 4K is going for 2,500. The top one, same size, 55 inch is going for. Looks like 47, it's about 4,700. All right, let's walk around TVs, man. It's like a, a, a guy's like, you know, home toy theater dream. Reminds me of like a Best Buy on steroids or Circuit City in America. Check out these TVs, man. This one is 5,700-ish. It's a... Uh, uh, Aquos. I forgot what uh, company makes Aquos. Uh, Sharp. Sharp makes Aquos. And uh, what is this one? It's a, is that a 70 inch? I think it's a 70 inch. This thing's huge. By the way, you guys are, I think, on the super wide uh, on the camera. I'm you're watching this film on an iPhone 14 Pro. I'm just walking around. Oh, this is a 48 inch. All these TVs are bigger than what I have at home. How about you guys? 
This will probably be premiered later today on the weekend. Uh, this is Sony. Sony's brand is Bravia. 55 inch is really popular these days. Look at that. Bravia is running for 2,400 ish. Give or take the exchange rate. Jesus. These are all Sony's now. Look at that. Bravia. You can see that. 65 inch. And that's what, that's what my, uh, some of my family wants. Oh my god. And these are very flat screen. I'm going to go to the back. You can see it's a very flat screen back there. This is a 65 inch. It's obviously beautiful. I don't have $6,000 for, close to $7,000 for this. <laughs> I mean, not, not extra money. Jeez. Well, let's get bigger. LG is up next. Cool, this is like the TV for, oh my God. This is Sony's uh, 83 inch right here. I think, I think it'll go my inches. Whatever the TV industry goes for. This is a, uh, oh my god, this is a uh, 1.6 meters, you can see there. That's the, how you can go by, 75, 85, 65, 55 is one meter. This thing is, looks like $11,000. Whoa, for, for the rich guy. Yeah, household. This is an LG. LG has Dolby Atmos. Oh my god, I can't see the price right now. Oh, here, here. This one's about a grand. A 50, 50 incher is a, not a grand. Very beautiful, the Korean makers make it. It's a little bit more reasonable in price. So I've never been here in the TV floor. Everything looks crazy. This is the LG 77 inch. Um, price is five grand, five grand. I'm kind of getting bored of TVs. They're just giant screens now. Whoa! These TVs have their own little, uh, I don't know, TV stands. 77 inch. What company makes this one? They all just look like a Toshiba. Giant screens now. They all look like giant screens on the wall. Oh, these are 85. That's an 85 inch. This is an 85 inch TV. Going for $15,000, it looks like. Oh my god. I look like wall hangers, these little bracket things. That thing is $300. Man, $300 could be a TV. So this was a TV section. On the uh, floor, I'm on. You guys watch this video, you'll know. So I'm just exploring you know, Yorobashi Akiba here in, uh, this was the AK TV I was telling you about. Hey, look, it's conveniently, looks like it's a $16,000. Look at the bottom. HK TV, made by Sony. Probably a Bravia then. Jeez, very beautiful. Sony Bravia, look at that, see? Man, I wanna, so this is, uh, what floor is this? Huh. Look at that. <laughs> um, it's a very big floor. How much should I wander? I think there's nothing left on this floor. This was floor four, I think. Let me turn around when I get up on the... This was floor four, TVs. Uh, let's see, what was floor five? Let's not waste any time. Floor 5 is home appliances. Oh yeah, I was here. Floor 5 is home appliances. I wonder if I've seen everything here. I just want to make sure. Um, let's call this as an extra video. Uh, I didn't get a chance to check out the washing machines. Guys, did you know? Oh, this is made by Hire. 85 liter, it's 320 bucks. Ish. Chinese maker. By the way, one thing awesome about Japanese uh, washing machines, oh, this is made by Hitachi. Some of them also act as dryers. And look, they open like this. Oh, is this locked? Well, I'm not gonna break it, so I'm gonna keep going. Check out what they got here. I didn't check out the, the whoa, those wine cellars here. 
I mean, obviously we have no space in Japan, so these are wine cellars, I believe. $600 wine cellar. Oh, nice, all these nice things. Look at that. I, I used to really want a front washer. This one's made by Estilio. What is that? I don't know. Check it out. Hey, look. I think this is also a dryer. Why did I open it? It's very... There it is. Oh, it is a dryer. It's probably just a dryer, maybe. It doesn't look like a washer. Hmm. Anyway. The one we have at home are washers and dryers. Look at that. So this is a Japanese dishwasher. Kind of like what I have at home. Thank God. I, I use it every day. That's pretty cool. How much is it? This is made by Panasonic. Um, which they make a lot of dishwashers. Oh, almost a grand, 900 bucks. A lot of times, I used to have this one, something like this. You have your sink here. You hook up this, you know, water pipe to your dishwasher. It's this tiny in Japan, right next to the sink. Um, the one I bought was only like two, three hundred bucks, but on Amazon. Not by uh, Amazon, uh, Pyasonic. It's by a smaller company, but um, similar. Looks like this inside. Very tiny. You can only wash like uh, one set of dinner dishes for two people. You have to put water with this uh, machine, uh, you know, spout into the machine. So you have to load it every time, or you can connect it. But uh, yeah, the one I have now is connected, but. Uh, before, I had to pour water in every time. And the water goes into a bucket at the bottom. Check it out. What is this? This is a, it's a cubo. Cubo, looks like it kills bacteria too while it dries. What is this? I can't even tell what company makes it. Very shiny looking touch buttons. Looks like, uh, hey, look, 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 it dries, it dries. I think this is a Panasonic dryer and washer. I think that's kind of what I have, but I don't think it looks this good. Mine's white. I used to want a front loading washer, but I, you know, you need a very spacey room and house to have those. Let's see what else. I'm walking around now. Washing machine's a little bit, ooh. Maybe I could open one. I hope they don't mind, I wanna open this one. Wow, looks like this inside. It's a normal washing machine. Look at all the touch buttons. They didn't have AI, what's that? I don't know what it does. Come on, so maybe I can talk to you. Ooh. Now to the bathrooms. Oh, that's exciting. Check out all the bathrooms, man. Oh my God, what's this? Oh, look guys, they have a jacket, jacket dryer here. This thing, you just put your jacket in the closet and it'll just like clean it, shake it. Made by LG though, wow. It's like a plan, just turn it on and off. You can see this is console, it's drying right now. It says drying. So that's really cool. It's made by LG. True steam, it's a steamer. Wow. It's a, called Styler. Pretty much gets rid of, uh, looks like the uh, allergens, the dust mites, the bacteria, and then it just steams your clothes. I could use that, but I can't afford that. How much does it cost? Does it say? Oh my God, uh, it looks like it costs um, 1,600? I can't afford 1,600. Anyway. These are more washers. Yeah, back to the wash list. Toto, guys, what makes Japan famous? You guys may have seen these. And, you know, it's a, it's a... It's got the bidet right there. We got one of those. And it's got a heated wash pad. It got the echo mode is what that leaf is. How much is this one? Oh, they're not even cheap, dude. This one's 650 bucks. I assume you have to install by yourself or get this company 
you got a Bashi camera to install it. Probably cost 50 bucks or something to get them installed. Oh, that's a cheap one. This one is uh, 390, oh, so 400 bucks. Let me see what it says. Got a white color, looks like you got a little uh, yellowish color. By the way, these are lifesaver. This, this got a little fan inside that sucks out all the like smelly air. <laughs> That's cool. And it washes you clean, bidet. Yeah, some even play music. Hey, look, here's a video. This is a video, it's a screen showing you what's going on there. Very cool. So, you know, they run about 300. This is one that's a thousand dollars. Jesus, by Panasonic. Oh, Panasonic, they make everything. What's so special about this one? They've got some kind of like nano e technology. I think this cleans the air. So that's their patented technology. Um, you know, what else is so special about this thing? This is comfortable, I guess. Saves energy. Saves energy. Um, I don't really know what's the difference. I mean, these things all look the same. The extra, extra functions, it turns into a thousand dollars. They're very low. Too. I love that. I'm not that tall, so very low to the ground. All right, let's keep going, guys. I'm just wandering around. What is it, the fifth floor now? I've lost track. I've seen a lot. Ooh, Panasonic also makes a steam room. A steamer. So, oh, what does this do? Some kind of steamer. Looks like it's a coat hanger that's also a steamer. Not very nice. Oh, these are all steamers, I guess. So that could be it. Looks like a coat hanger steamer by Panasonic. Where's the price? Oh, wow, it's 200 bucks, it looks like. Is that it? Oh, makes, I think it gets rid of smells. Yeah, it gets rid of smells and stuff with their nano aid technology. Panasonic steamer. That's cool, a lot of uh, weird high-tech electronics that, oh yeah, they're all steamers. And this is the area for sewing machine. Brother is a huge brand. It's a three hundred dollars sewing machine. He even has a little digital display and really does every kind of sewing. All those little designs for well, high quality. Thing. Oh, by the way, did you guys know there's this little machine here? It's basically a heat, hot air pump. Pumps in hot air into your mattress. Right? So cool. Two hundred dollars. You just press the on and well, that's a stop button. Where's the on button? Well, I guess this is also the on button. You time it, so the timer, and it'll just like pump in air into your comforter because it's really cold in Japan. The whole line of these from around look it looks like a hundred thirty bucks to pump hot air by Irish Oyama. By the way, this is a great brand, Japanese brand. If you live in Japan, get that cheaper, uh, more reasonable prices for life. Always good. Oh, look at that. It's the robot that does uh, Echovax. It's $1,500. What does it do? I think it cleans. Yeah, yeah, it's got a cleaner and it's got a vacuumer. So wipes and it sucks. And it goes back into its own little station. It's round, it's huge. That's incredible. Okay, that was the vacuum area. It's a lot. Dyson's a pretty big brand here. It's basically Electrolux, which is a, I'm guessing it's a Japanese brand. If, no, correct me if I'm wrong. I think it's a Japanese brand. And there's a lot of other smaller brands. Not a lot of space in Japan. Oh, I like this. Like. Rooms are like square, they're not round, so I love this shape. Electrolux also, right now, these uh, robot volumes, vacuums are all the rage. Dyson is all the rage here, huge brand, I have it. We have one of these. You can, by the way, a little tip, if you don't want to pay this price, which is, uh, Dyson goes anywhere from, look at that, like 700 bucks, 900 bucks for one of these. 
Um, you can get them from the uh, second hand shop when someone just doesn't want their Dyson anymore. You just gotta be, uh, you go to places like uh, Second Street, which is a second hand shop chain in Japan. Oh, this is, was that the air purifier? It looks like an air purifier. Electrolux air purifier. Doesn't say the price though. Whoa, if I press it, what happens? Whoa, whoa, check it out. Air purifier gonna happen now. That was dusty air. And the air purifier is, uh, the cloud is still there. What the? Hurry up. I'm sorry, I'm impatient. Let's see how long it takes to get rid of the hot. I still see dust in the air. Yeah, that's not bad, it took uh, less than a minute. Oh, the air is clean, clean, clean air. Happy New Year. <laughs> that's not bad. That's not bad, it took uh, less than a minute. All right, let's go. This is floor five of uh, home appliances of uh, Yodobashi Akiba. I'm just going to other places I haven't been. If you want to see other floors, check out my other live streams. Uh, my last live stream, I did some of the other floors. This is floor six, the gaming floor. <laughs> uh, I think I've been here a lot. Uh, I wonder if I should go somewhere else. Yeah, I never go somewhere else. Let's uh, go to another floor. Uh, by the way, this place has character figures, model trains, software, games, bicycles. But I think I'm gonna go to floor seven, which I never go. I'm just gonna go to other floors and check out what else is here. Whoa. Floor 7 has suits and eyeglasses and uh, so it's basically like a mall. Yeah, look at that. Grand Sachs. This is a shop that sells uh, nice gifts and uh, you know, these are wallets by Takeo Kikuchi. I used to have some wallets like this. It's more like this. This is by Calvin Klein. Takeo Kikuchi. They don't really show prices because it's one of those... Sh I don't really have to dig for the price. I'm sure they don't want me to. Kind of like a bag or a gift shop where you buy bags for men. I really recommend Porter. I used to have this bag. It's, uh, it's a backpack. It's also a briefcase. It's a three-in-one. They actually go for about $300, so it's not cheap, but um, two pockets, very nice, simple, looks nice. Except the only thing I didn't like were these uh, huge metal um, teeth. So if you have a nice jacket, which I did do, it uh, dug into my jacket, that's why I got rid of it. This is the gray one, they're black and green. That's uh, by Yoshida and Company Porter, Tokyo, Japan. This is the black version. They also have bigger versions, obviously, here. So and they also have, the Porter is a very popular Japanese brand, very nice. This is the bigger, biggest version I believe, I don't know, it's going to $500. This has like two sections instead of one. They also have a green version of this bag, maybe even more colors, but that's what they got here at Grand Sachs at uh, Yorobashi Camera 7th floor. Now I'm just wandering around. The suit company is over there. Those are suits, I just skipped it. I'll come back probably later. Just keep walking around. Tokyo Paul is documenting Japan. All right, let's keep going. Ladies shop here. It's like New Year's sale. They have uh, gift bags. One thing they have in Japan and, uh, during New Year's is called Fukubukuro. Discounted random gift bags. I didn't buy any because they're discounted. I don't like to buy things discount because uh, they're typically of lower sales popularity or perhaps even quality. Things like even Disney or shops can't sell, they put in those discounted bags. It's a big thing in this country though. There's a lot of bag shops for men. A lot of people here are guys buying stuff. Tower Records up here, whoa, and it looks like a little training gym. Cool. A stretching gym. This is uh, 
Your ring though, it's a accessory shop, cool. These are paper models, so beautiful. Jujutsu Kaisen, that's a demon slayer in the back. I think what's this Jojo. Uh, we got Ghibli here. Very beautiful. These are paper models, very good for gifts. I, got, I could send you guys some. The, the models are right here. I don't see the prices. 50% off. It's uh, kind of like New Year's sale right now. There's a lot of bag shops up on the seventh floor. I didn't know that. I never come up here. This is Tower Records, I believe. Yeah. Is it Tower Records? I think so. I went to, oh, Jins is here. Hey, it reminds me back in the clay. A lot of glasses shops. This is a really beautiful pair. We got a collaboration with Doraemon. These look like Doraemon glasses. Like blue inside. Kind of cute. Gold. It's metal. How much is this pair run? Oh, dang. It's $120. I think that's including the, the eye, eye test. You know, they give you an eye exam as well as a lens comes with it. And uh, yeah, the glasses I'm wearing right now is uh, Jin's. Check this out guys. I think this is also magnetic or clip on. It's magnetic I think. Was it magnetic? Yeah, it's magnetic. It just clipped on. They've got glasses here in Japan that are magnetic. So maybe the magnets are right here, right here, my finger pointing. It just clips right on. Clips right on to uh, to the glasses and here you go. You got sunglasses. This is a uh, called Jin Switch. I've wanted a pair of these. So these are Japanese glasses that uh, have uh, another attachment, which is a sunglass part. Very nice. It's almost 200 bucks. With the tax, it's 190. 200 US. Nice. I like it, but I couldn't find a style like last time with these magnetic sunglass attachable glasses. All these empty shelves don't look good. Tower Records, is this Tower Records? It might be a bookstore. Tower Records is so over there, but some other store maybe? It's all magazines and stuff. Look at that, calendars. Cute little calendars. Magazines are very, still very big in Japan. Probably mostly K-pop and, uh, you know, models and you know, fashion. It's still very big here. One thing I like to see is the guys area. Because they have, look at that. Magazines about plastic models. Magazines about gunpla. Just open this a little bit. A lot of beautiful stuff. Look at that. Wow. Wow, that's really beautiful. How much is this? These are very heavy, right? They're printed on very nice paper. It's 27 bucks. That's significant. Some people have whole rooms dedicated to these. Just reading these models. Ultimate Spider-Man. Wow. How much is this? By the way, Spider-Man's my favorite uh, character. Well, it's 19. It's 20 bucks. Godzilla official mook. What is that? What is a mook? Is it a like a lookbook? Okay, it's all about Godzilla and the history of Godzilla. Want any any? Whoa, cool. Basically, like a funky, weird story. Oh, it's only seven dollars. Not bad. Cool. Wandering around Japan. I will. Hmm. Oh, this Kim Tokyo right there. It's car books. Hmm. What are the other guidebooks? I usually look at. Oh, this is a very shiny book. What's this? Some kind of design or something. I don't get it. McDonald's here. Manga. It's, it's like a TV guide. Yeah, it's TV guide Japan. That's Matamoto June. Wow. Anime 
folks. Huh. Inside a giant... By the way, leave a comment if you want me to explore more of the bookstore. I don't know how much this is interesting. Oh, this, these are guidebooks to all over Japan. If you understand a little bit of Japanese, you might want to get one. It's five dollars. This is Osaka guidebook. I hear Lemisan. I've used this a little bit. Oh, it's a grape parfait. I love it at in Osaka. Okinawa. This is called Dudu Brew brand guidebook. Get it? It's only five dollars. This is Ito. That's an ocean area. Hakone. Okinawa. No five dollars. It's a good buy by Ludo Boo. Hey, this book is English. <laughs> Let's see how an English book looks in uh, Japan's way for middle school students. That looks like that. I want to text less. Look at another example. Hey, Vinay. How can I buy a ticket for your comedy show? Uh, I'm bored. Cool. <coughs> Dang, Matsumoto Jun's everywhere. <coughs> he used to be part of the group Rashi. Just wandering around. Uh, this is the seventh floor. So, did I mention Yorobashi camera in uh, Akihabara is huge? Right, so, yeah, in uh, Jin's, you can just pick up your glasses. It takes probably like 40 minutes less after you get your eye exam. You just get the, like, they, they just put the lenses in, clean it up for you. Gotcha palm. Wow, I love these. I just want to get one. It's $5 for a chair. Looks like bacteria. Ew. Or some kind of fungus. Hey, it's the Rock Ten Panda. That's crazy. They're selling their brand for... 300 yen. Let's see what are, oh, this is creepy. It. Oh, they've changed from cats to random little animals. 300 yen. Whoa, Kawasaki bike. It looks like it's just a, it's not the whole bike model. And it's 300 yen right there. Hmm. So we got a shoe store here. Really big ABC Mart shoe store. One thing in Japan, they, they definitely make it clear. So this is uh, for guys and girls. It's 80 bucks. It's, uh, I really want this shoe. Adidas Stan Smith. Do you have these in your country? I don't even know if they have this uh, in America. And again, I don't really care about shoes as much in America, but these are really nice looking. It's about 80 bucks. Look at that, 87 plus tax. Oh, the tax rate in Tokyo is about 10%, man. It might have gone up too. Whoa. These are shoes with holes. That's new. It's from Reebok. It's uh, 54 with tax. Huh. Shoes with holes. That's a new thing. More gotcha pollen. There was some on the last floor. I'm charged to this uh, crayon chan. It has 400 yen. Christmas bell. Now, yeah, if you need to call the loved ones, please get me some uh, soda, dear. Some chips. Hey, it's Pokemon. Yo, these are good. It's uh, Bubble Sword, Charmander. I don't know what his name is. Hino Arashi in Japanese. This is Nare Toro. Whoa, more Pokemon. New ones. These are going for 300 yen, not bad. Good price for a kid. I think there's a golf range up here. Oh, I'm still wondering, like a driving range. Oh, there's another floor. Sheesh, eight floors up here. Hey guys, did you know? Whoa, there's a Daiso here. Daiso here, it's a 100 yen store. Uh, very cool. Daiso in Yorobashi. Did you know? I saw sells 100 yen flowers. I don't know what these flowers are. Maybe Frank McLeod knows, but uh, 
What are these? Cotton balls? They look very nice. Daiso, Daiso. I'm going to sell cotton balls. These are 100 yen. They look so real. Wow. This is makeup, clothing, living room, everything. Interior, everything from bottles. They're all 100 yen. Got your room slippers. I could use one of these. You don't get one. I always used to come in these stores and buy something. Hmm. Washable slippers, that's useful. As you know, in Japan, they have bathroom slippers and they have slippers for the rest of the house. I really don't get the point of bathroom slippers though, because uh, I can't help wearing them into the rest of the house or forgetting to put them on. You can even have a sewing. Look at all this yarn here for a dollar. Yarn, you can start a hobby here at Daiso. I'm just wandering around Daiso now. This is camping gear, eh? For a uh, Emmy song, right? Camping kit, camping kit. What's this? It's a little tin. Oh, this little tin's like 10 bucks, though. All right, let's keep going. What else is around here? Hmm. And check this out. Japanese have turned this, uh, this technology of, uh, these are supposed to like, uh, not, the water's supposed to evaporate really easily. So these coasters have that special rock that lets water <coughs> evaporate. I'm not what sure what material it is, but, uh, so when you put your coaster or your can of Coke on this, the water should just disappear really quickly. It's good. I heard some of these had a asbestos a long time ago, so buy with caution, but this should be cool. It's only 100 yen. Look at all these coasters. Japanese. This is, this is miso soup. The miso soup. Look at a giant bowl. These are your rice bowls. They're actually surprisingly, you know, not so kind of shallow compared to like Chinese ones I used to eat from a lot less this might be the alcohol cup it's really pretty for 100 yen look at that it's a little heavy these are 500 yen look at a double layer glass oh i hate heat these are great these are beautiful daiso is really up in its game huh look at that for 100 yen it's really heavy there's a quality oh look smartphone stands you can never have enough smartphone stands uh oh, this song is not good. I gotta cut that out soon. So I gotta get out of dice from now because they're playing a copyright song. How'd I get up? What's this? Are these gummies? Look like gummies. Yeah, they look like gummy, dry fruit. Candy. They have some candy here for 100 yen. I can't get I can't get out of Daiso. I'm like lost in Daiso. Playing music. Ping pong balls for 100 yen? Nice. Uh oh. See what I am. They sell shirts for 700 yen. Size L. Is that for Yari? L for Yari. Uh -huh. They have more nano blocks, but it's called Petite Blocks. Daiso has their own brand. Lego's got a competition. It even has a dartboard. That's cool. Toys, guys. Look at the toys. See, like Japanese kids are very lucky. Oh, found my way out. Thank God. And I'm back at Soup Company. So, some umbrellas too here are 100 yen. By the way, Kaido, it's a good word to know if you want. These are heating pads. Looks like you have eight. You peel them, stick them onto your body, and then they uh, provide heat for uh, several hours. These look like eight hours, so it's very nice. Very competitive. I look gloves. I kind of use something similar to live stream, except mine have open, open fingers for the thumb and index. But uh, you know, gloves for live streaming. So that's a uh, hand warmer technology here. Chemical, 100 yen. Suit company. You know, one of those 
shop for good suits. I'd say it's like a pretty good quality. I, uh, it's about $300 a suit, actually. Uh, let's see, yeah, this one's $500, it's a very nice suit. Look at that. It's pretty nice. But uh, yeah, well, I actually shop from the shop, but not this one. I prefer, I prefer one in Ginza, but this uh, is a chain. Suit Select is the, the, like the competitor. But I prefer the suit company. 70% sale, geez. Yeah, so another trick. Coming around after New Year's, you get huge sales in Japan. If you like Japanese stuff. One reason I like Japanese stuff is because they fit me. I'm kind of Japanese sizes. So these, look at all the variety of colors and selection. 20% off. Looks like uh, just for students, though, I think. What's the price? It's probably like $40, $50. What does it say? Yeah. Tie is three, three, nine, 40 bucks. I'm rounding up, by the way. These designs are nice. How many of you guys wear a suit? Oh, this jacket is on sale. 50% off. Wow, that's really good. It's a uh, 36, 360. Whoa, this shoe but from Regal Shoe Sun Floor is uh, waterproof? Jeez. It's Gore-Tex. Probably very expensive. Yeah, 200 bucks. That is pretty cool. What is upstairs? Oh, look, look, look. Upstairs is the gourmet information here. Always check information, gourmet. This is all the restaurants. Pizza, toys is sixth floor, home electronics, audio, visual, camera, PC peripherals. Yup. 